Hi guys, I'm Andrew from Andrew Smith Salons in Hampshire. Today I'm going to go through a tutorial um, on one of our Lazy Wave looks. As you can see, my beautiful model Sam has got bob length hair. So what we're going to go for today is a kind of full bodied, kind of messy wave look. Um, the way we're going to create that is using the Hot Tools um, 24 karat gold plated tongs. I love to use these in different directions for this look, just to give masses of volume and kind of like a messy texture. We will be leaving the ends straighter, which will kind of keep that kind of real bold look on the edges, which is kind of really, really um, on trend at the moment. A little bit about what we've already done. We've pre-washed and shampooed with Milkshake's Daily Shampoo and Conditioner. This is a really cool kind of frequent use, moisture protein balance shampoo. The hair that doesn't really dictate too much. So we're not working with kind of coarse or damaged or over-processed hair here. We're working with really kind of natural virgin hair, if you like. What we're going to do is work vertical sections, so down the head this way. My favourite product for using with hot tools is no inhibition eco hairspray. This is just going to give us really cool hold but also protect a little bit of that against the heat. So I spritz that, not too close, comb that through so that we know it's gone all the way through and then with our tongs I'm not going to open the clamp because sometimes I think that that can make life a bit difficult at home also, it can create dents in the hair. So I just leave that closed completely. Almost use it like it's a wand. So as you can see, I've wrapped that round. First, first section is away from the face and we're just leaving the ends out straight. I normally hold, hold the tongs on the hair for around five to 10 seconds. Then, leave to cool down, you can put on it a little bit, but as you can see, we've got that kind of way, and then we've got a straight edge. The next section, again vertical. This time, we're gonna go in the opposite direction. I always try and make sure that I comb each section through after spraying just so that the, the protection and the fix is going to be constant. So here we're going to go towards the face. And remember, these are what we call our lazy, messy waves. So it doesn't matter if the hair is textured in its cut and you can see little bits fall out of the tongs. The key is just to carry on. I think at home too many times clients kind of think, oh that bit's not quite right or a little bit's fallen out. Literally just carry on. Because as you'll see in the end we will just be messing the hair up to create that really kind of lived in look. Repeat this all the way throughout the head. So our first one is back, our second one is forward. Now we're going to come back again. So as you can see, we've worked our way in our vertical sections, one way then the other. I always try and finish up, if I can, with the front one coming off the face, because I think for anyone's kind of face, it's more flattering to have their hair coming away from the face. So as you can see, this is my last one. So this one's coming away from the face. One 
cross by your spritz. And then you can even use the paddle brush if you want a kind of softer kind of feel to the hair or a wide tooth comb. Literally just comb through all of the waves. Just for a little bit of texture, I use the No Emission Volumizing Powder. This I absolutely love. Some powders that you can get for the hair, literally you put in, you shake out and it all falls out. This has almost like a tackiness to it, which means it's going to stay in the hair and create really good texture. It's really good for kind of like your day two look, where you just want to kind of add that little bit of lived in texture. And dust that all over. Give the hair a really good shape. see we've got a really kind of beautiful natural kind of almost beachy messy lazy wave for a little bit more hold you can go for a little bit of dry aerosol hairspray um, again just to add that little bit of texture I love you to use dry products um, so even the eco hairspray is pump action it's wet as it hits the hair it dries instantly Anything dry is going to build the hair up. Um, it's not going to weigh it down, it will build the hair up. So I love dry spray. This has a little bit of hold. And as you can see, keeping the ends out creates that kind of real heavy, healthy bob look. Okay, there we go, hope you enjoyed it. For more of our online tutorials, check out our social media or our new YouTube channel.